seniors. Just because you're educated and well-versed in finances doesn't mean you can't fall for a scam. I recently talked about the financial expert who was convinced to give $50,000 in cash to a sophisticated scammer. Also this month, a 76-year-old college professor revealed she had been scammed after calling a number that popped up on her computer. Please don't do that. After being threatened with arrest over the phone, something law enforcement does not do, she sent $187,000 to what she thought was the federal government for safekeeping. Not satisfied with their haul, the scammers convinced her to keep sending money for months until she was out $400,000. And after decades as a professor, she's now relying on food banks and a GoFundMe her daughter started to raise money on her behalf. She made her story public to help other seniors, so please learn from her mistakes. Mm -hmm.